Eivor's here. Now we can settle this. What seems to be troubling you? <laughs> this stick in the mud doesn't want to celebrate Ostara. It's the Equinox. The veil between our worlds will be dangerously thin. We need to prepare. Why not both? Prepare for the Equinox and celebrate Ostara. I see you have already started on the decorations. <laughs> of course we have. Here's what we do. We've also organized some new events and brought back some favorites from you. <laughs> All this noise and merriment will attract the spirits. I will aid you in protecting the settlement, Aldous. Good. Find me after dark. And before he explains the egg hunt to you, just know I was coerced. Now then, there is much to do. Norvid will need your help decorating, and Maida might need some words of encouragement. She didn't take being crowned the May Queen very well. That is a lot. And the Zag Hunt. Oh, it's already started. Speak with me when you are ready to start the hunt. I told you need my help. Eivor, yes. I've spent so much time filling my shop with new Ostara items that I haven't had time to finish decorating a settlement. You want me to decorate? Of course. A new banner here, a pile of bones there. You can even change the big tree if you'd like. I worry that my taste may not be the same as everyone else's. Enough. You'll do fine. Oh, don't forget to play some of the games. You'll want to collect as many festival tokens as possible. I've got some really good items for you. Here, have some tokens on me. Well, thank you, Norvid. I'll do my best to decorate the settlement. But if it's a disaster, I won't be blaming you. Show me what you have. Have a look. See you later. Maida, I hear that you've been chosen as the May Queen. Ugh, I hate it. I told them I didn't want to, but everyone seemed so excited. And now I have to wear this horrible flower crown. It's unbefitting of a warrior. Perhaps you would feel pride if you had a crown that matched your spirit. Well, this may sound silly, but I want a crown made from a beast, not a garden. Fair them overheard Suniva talking about an animal that is killing much of the wildlife in the forest. She hasn't had the chance to track it yet, but I would be honored to wear a crown made from such a predator. A request that I can easily grant. I will return with the crown befitting of our May Queen. Thank you, Eivor. I will be in your debt.
this looks worth trying. A drinking game always is. <laughs> the rules are, one, you drink until you're the last one standing. Two, end the rules. <laughs> Want to play? Of course. Quite the guzzler. Try again any time. We've brought back the fist fighting tournament. Good. It's been too long. Any changes from last time? We have added new rules to make it more challenging. After each round you win, you will earn tokens. You can leave with those tokens or bet them on your next fight and earn even more. And if I should lose that next fight? Then you leave with nothing. The greater the risk, the more the reward. I see now how it's more challenging. Ready to fight! I am. I'll finish you! for the next round. I'm ready. for the next round. I'm ready.
ready for the next round. Yes, I'm ready. for the next round. Yes, I'm ready. Are you ready for the next round? I'll take my token, Mr. Cinema. I have business elsewhere. Playing it safe. Here are your tokens. What is all this? You shoot as many spinning targets as you can, as quick as you can. Care to give it a go? Put a bow in my hand. Time it so the target faces you. You make your ancestors proud. I ought inside, you shoot well. Incredible shit! 
shooting. Not bad, but I'm sure you can do better. Try again if you like. Ah, good. You're here. Where is Olvis? Yes, well, you see, Olvis and I got into a little... I don't imagine he took that well. No, he did not. He told me that if I was so sure that his fears were baseless, then I should perform the ritual in his stead. Have you ever done anything like this? Goodness, no. But he left a list. Anyway, how hard can it be? What does the list say? It says to start by lighting fires round the settlement to create a protective barrier against spirits. <laughs> Utter nonsense and a waste of time. Perhaps, but I would feel better honoring Alvis's wishes. Of course, of course. Go light the fires and then return to me. There are more steps on this list. That looks like a fire pit. May this fire protect us. I see a fire pit over there. This should burn brightly. Need your eyes, my friend. Yeah!
until morning. Show me what lies ahead. Fires have been lit. I should return to Arke. Fires have been lit around Raven's Thorpe. Good. Now follow me. The next step takes place in the forest. You warriors are so worried about your spirits. Like today's any different than any other day. Be careful, Aki. That kind of thinking can leave you defenseless in the face of the unknown. Perhaps, or perhaps it leaves me more time to work on my craft and not spend so much time worrying. What does Alves ask for this next step? We're to draw out any spirits that have crossed into our world and would do us harm and destroy them. And how will we find them? There will be a rune or ward that has let them into our world. 
I assume we'll know it when we see it. Seems easy enough. And how do we banish the spirits? Hmm. It doesn't say. Maybe we can talk to Punch to be a reliable deterrent. Okay. Hmm. All this says this ritual must be performed at night. We should wait until the sun has set. I'm here, okay. Come, Eivor. Let's finish this foolish errand. Odin's This whole thing is our foolish errand. done. I can barely believe it. We both saw that, didn't we? Yes, Sake. It would seem you owe all this an apology. I do. But I would never give him the satisfaction. It's back to the brewery for me. Creature should be close by. I should begin tracking.
through carnage. This must be the work of the beast. This creature has been guarded in a way I've never before seen. The beast must have talons or claws. There is a trail of blood. It should lead me to the beast. Easy, friend. I'm here to slay the beast of the woods. Oh. oh, thank the gods. I was certain this would be my end. Tell me, where has the beast gone? Well, it's there. Do you, do you not see it? I see only a chicken. Where's a clever beast? Monster! Please! You must kill it! Very well. It is safe. Where did you find that chicken? Hell? Oh, all my thanks. Oh, I still can't believe Romy attacked me. Romy? Yeah, the chicken you just killed. I, I was bringing her to market when a bear appeared. I, I thought I was done for, but Romy defended me. She took down the bear like it was nothing. I, I, I tried to calm her down, but once she had a taste of blood, oh, she was beyond... It's uh, a very special chicken. And to think she was about to be dinner. Oh, I'll never harm another chicken again. Tell me, may I use Romy to craft a crown for a friend? Oh, yes, of course. It would be an honor to have something of Romy live on. I I'll even help you with it. Hey, Queen, I give you your crown. Eivor, it's wonderful. What horrible beast gave its life to make me such a powerful object? It was a winged creature, the likes of which I've never encountered before. Its beak dripped of blood, and its talons were sharper than any blade. I can tell that it was a powerful foe. I wish I had been there with you to see it in action. It was truly something to behold. You're more confident in your role now. Yes, Savor. I will wear this crown with pride. Thank you.
Aha! Ready. Of course. Guzzler. Try again any time. Show me what you have. Have a look. to go. See you soon. But... What do you see, Sunan? <laughs> 